Well, this week is the big move for the new John R. O'Shai Children's Hospital. Friday is opening day for the brand new hospital on the medical campus. So much has gone into all this, and this morning Adam Beniti introduces us to the woman behind making sure this transition goes smoothly. It's just 1.2 miles from the old hospital on Bryant Street to the new one on Ellicott. But that does nothing to lessen the challenge of this move. Because in theory, any baby that's delivered on the 10th should happen here, but it might not. Yeah, exactly. That's why Kaleida has hired Cassandra Church to oversee all of it. I think we're all very excited and feel very confident in the safe move because safety is the goal. She was born in Syracuse, but grew up in Louisiana now lives in Washington, D.C., and has led two similar hospital moves in the nation's capital and in Virginia. And as a former nurse, says she's uniquely qualified. I like to think I plan things fairly well and logically, um, and luckily I'm a nurse by background, so I can sort of speak the clinical and do the planning at the same time. If I'm the nurse that requests patient transport to pick my patient up to go to x-ray and come back, I could do it from this floor even though I'm not with them, right? Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So many challenges in moving from the old to the new. And since this summer, she says they've rehearsed different variations of this move 12 times, practicing along the main ambulance route, among others, from Bryant to Delaware, to North, to Ellicott, and the new hospital. So we did it first with empty ambulances and empty trucks, um, and then we started asking um, some of our staff to volunteer their children and family members to be my pretend patients a handful of times. If I can get two volunteers. And speaking of volunteers, students from St. Joe's were just a few of the hundreds from the community that have turned out to help make this day possible. They call this place the city of good neighbors. I've heard that Does a few that times. Does that make sense to you? Uh, yeah, it's amazing. You know, I. Grew up in Louisiana, and we're very proud of our uh, southern hospitality, but Buffalo is like no other city I've been in. Adam Benini, Channel 2 News Daybreak. So we were excited to bring you live coverage all morning long on Friday of the move and a look back at how we got here to a $270 million new children's hospital opening on the medical campus. A, really a game changer for um, health care in western New York. Yeah, so. big, big day. It's awesome. Yeah.